Get water, okay? Get water. Mm? Do this. Make sure your feet is touching the ground. So make sure you're walking barefooted. Make sure your feet is touching the ground, okay? Walk to the entrance of your house, okay? Where you literally walk into your house. Get to that place. But let's pretend this is my entrance, right? All you do is mention some of the names of your fathers. The ones you remember, the ones you want to honor, okay? Mention your name. Over water, water is one of the most powerful things you can find. And once you speak over the water and you pour it to the ground, the earth can never forget what you have done. Get your water and mention the name of your father, your mother, your grandfather, whatever it is. Mention their name. So I would mention my, my, my names of some of my fathers, right? Or two for Bedu Bonsu. Nana. Then you pour it to the ground. Okay? Mention their name. Like, I give you water. Let me say English. Let me say it in English so that everybody can understand. I give you water. I give you water. I mention the name of my ancestor, my father. I can, it could be your father, your mother, whoever. I give you water. Wherever you are, I am so sorry I have never honored you. I'm so sorry I have never given water to say thank you for living, for giving your life to me. For ensuring that you live, you exist, and you give back to my fathers to also give back to me. I'm grateful. Say it in your language. I'm only speaking English because I want everybody to understand what I'm doing. Right? This water. I knock on your doors. Whichever realms you are, I knock on your doors. I give you water. Take this water from your grandchild and you mention your name. Could you bend too? Take this water from my hands. Drink this water. Quench whatever thirst you have had all these years. You can mention as many grandparents, grandfathers, ancestors that you have. Take this water. I'm giving it to you. I'm honoring you. Quench whatever thirst that you've had. I've come to a realization that I don't even understand a lot of things. And most of the things that I believe now are foreign to you. Are foreign to our ways. At least if there's a devil out there, I know you cannot be that devil because you gave back to my father and my father's gave back to me. If you are indeed real and you are in, you, you indeed can hear me, receive this water and speak to me. Come and speak to me in my dreams. Teach me the ways, the history. Teach me where I'm coming from. Teach me the things that my fathers did, the trade, the business, the, 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 the intelligence, the wisdom, the gifts that my fathers operated in. Because I've fallen off the way. Now I want to be able to come back to the track. I'm not giving this to anything, any, just, just teach me what you did to become successful. The things you did to become who you are, the great person that you became in my family. The powers that you could conjure, the healing that you did, the authority that you you were a great and, and, and a renowned chief, chief, king, priest, whatever. I honor you. Receive water from my hands. Remember your grandchild and pay me a visit and talk to me. Reveal things to me. Let no other being, no other person show up in my dreams but you. I've seen your picture. I've heard how you conducted, so I'll have an idea when you come. And in my sleep, talk to me, reveal yourself to me, say something to me. Connect me back to the intelligence, the, the knowledge, the truth that we've missed all these years. So that I can continue the legacies that you came to build. Nana, I thank you. Nana, I thank you. Nana, I thank you. I share this drink with you. Mm, mm, mm. That's it, you're done. Just do this, you're done. And let me, let me tell you, when you do it the first time, you don't see anything, do it again. Do it again, keep doing it. For after 14 days, after 21 days, if you don't see anything, then it means your grandparent does not exist. But I promise you, if what I know is true, and your grandparent actually are still alive and not into some judgment, some hell waiting, They'll come speak to you and they will reveal mysteries to your life. And these mysteries will change 
who you are for the rest of your life. And I'm promising you, listen, but just do this for me. Once they come and speak, whatever you become in this world, always honor them. Wherever you find yourself, always honor them. You doing this over water, pouring it to the mother earth, the combination of water and earth, this is one of the most powerful prayers you can pray. Do this and let's see if your parents will not come and speak to you.